With cable, satellite, and internet, binge-watching TV shows has never been easier. But with more TV shows comes more unanswered questions and plot holes. Keep in mind we are discussing major plot points in these shows, so there will most definitely be spoilers. Here are 10 TV mysteries that have yet to be solved. Also, don't forget that at any point during this video, you can click subscribe to stay up to date on more tv horrific videos like this one. Stranger Things It's hard to imagine that even Stranger Things could be coming to Stranger Things. <laughs> But the show still has a lot of explaining to do. First of all, where's Eleven? Where's the girl? We all saw her disintegrate after sacrificing herself to take out the Demogorgon, but then later Sheriff Hopper leaves Eleven's favorite food in a box in the forest. We can't help but wonder if he knows something that we don't. Is she hiding out in the woods to avoid causing any trouble? No. I mean, you can, but it'd be really weird. Is she stuck in the Upside Down? Or is she in some new place we've never even heard of? Then of course we have Will puking up a creepy black slug and uncontrollably jumping between dimensions. What's that about? Here's hoping we get some answers in Season 2. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm okay. Westworld while Maeve and company are trying to escape in the finale, they stumble upon what seems to be the making of a completely separate world. The door they pass through has an SW symbol, and inside are a bunch of people who look like samurai or shogun. Maeve asks the question that's on all the viewers' minds. What is this place? But keeping with the theme of the show, the only answer we get is... It's complicated. So what is SW? Samurai World? Shogun World? Is this a park that is currently open to the public, or is it under construction? It also begs the question, are there more than just two parks? We're feeling a little lost here, J.J. Abrams. Help us out. Mr. Robot we know that White Rose said something to Angela that made her completely abandon her mission to bring down E Corp, which enabled the Dark Army to continue their plans. Do you ever think that if you imagined or believed in something, it would come true? What we don't know is why, and we're not certain where her loyalties lie. Has she joined the Dark Army, or is she holding on to the information to use for later? But now that she's all filled in, did she reveal anything to the Dark Army? Do they know that Elliot has a split personality? What will she tell him when he wakes up? We have so many questions that we can't wait to figure out the answers in Season 3. How long have I been asleep for? Sherlock. Aside from John Watson, Mrs. Hudson, and sometimes Mycroft, Sherlock really doesn't show any emotional attachment to anyone. Oh, Big Brother is watching you. Literally. Not even Molly Hooper, who has always had a major crush on him. However, there is one person who has without fail captivated him for years, the woman, Irene Adler. What we know of their relationship is that Sherlock saved her from being executed and that they shoot the occasional text to each other. But what is their actual relationship status? Where is Irene? This person is the only girl who could actually hold Sherlock's interest. Huh? And yet their relationship hasn't really been explored since a scandal in Belgravia. We want to see more. I was just playing the game. Game of Thrones Season 6 was loaded with answers to age-old questions like Who are Jon Snow's real parents? And why does Hodor talk like a Pokemon? Hold the door! Hold the door! But that doesn't mean we're satisfied yet. There are still plenty of unexplained mysteries that need to be solved. First of all, who died and made Cersei queen? Oh, right, Tommen. But does that really make her queen? If not, it doesn't seem to matter anymore. The road to the throne is paved with blood, and anyone who would have objected either isn't around or dead. Perhaps more important on a grander scale, though, is the mark put on Bran by the Night's King. Is that mark enough to allow the White Walker's passage beyond the wall? If it is, and winter has finally come, we can probably kiss the rest of the main cast goodbye. The Walking Dead. The end of season 6 of The Walking Dead was quite possibly the biggest cliffhanger of the series. They built up suspense for like half the episode, and then gave a giant middle finger to the viewers by not revealing who died. We finally got our answer in season 7, which was devastating, but it was such a long wait to find out. However, many fans are still waiting for their very first question to be answered, which is, how? How did this all get started? Turns out we may never know. Robert Kirkman, the writer of the comic books, has said that he knows how the outbreak got started, but doesn't plan on sharing that information with anyone until the comics end, and possibly not even then. This is one mystery that will stay unsolved for a long, long time. The Flash. Savitar is a mysterious baddie that not even many comic book readers know about. After all, he only appeared in about a dozen Flash comics out of thousands of issues. This gives the writers of the TV show a lot of room to write and make this guy whoever they want. What we know of Savitar is that he considers himself the god of speed. Who are you? Savitar, the god of speed. 
and he apparently knows enough about the Flash crew to give them a prophecy of what's to come. One shall betray you, one shall fall, one will suffer a fate worse than death. So who belongs to which prophecy? A betrayal is straightforward, but one shall fall? Fall from grace? Fall from a building? And what is a fate worse than death? Maybe being stuck in the speed force? We can't wait to see how it all plays out, and if it can be altered with time travel. The Simpsons. <clears throat> the Simpsons. Everyone knows that the Simpsons live in Springfield, but no one knows where Springfield actually is. It was revealed in 2012 that the inspiration of Springfield came from Springfield, Oregon, which is near the creator Matt Groening's hometown. So we know where the inspiration comes from, but where is this place in the actual show? There have been a few episodes that hint at the location, but they tend to contradict each other and typically don't make sense. In fact, in the Simpsons movie, Ned Flanders says that there are four states that border Springfield. Look at that. You can see the four states that border Springfield, Ohio. Nevada, Maine, and Kentucky. Oh yeah. Which are nowhere near each other. We might be able to deduce where the town is located in the real world, but certainly never in the cartoon world. The Big Bang Theory. Leonard Hofstadter, Sheldon Cooper, Rash Kuthupali, Howard Wolowitz, Penny. These are the names of the beloved characters we have known ever since the pilot episode of The Big Bang Theory. As you can see, one of these names isn't quite finished. Penny does not have a last name. At least she didn't until she and Leonard got married. But her maiden name is still a mystery, which of course means her entire family is currently without a last name. <laughs> so good. Unfortunately, this is another question that will never be answered. This mind is capable of advanced multitasking. If she was ever even given a last name, the writers have said that they have no plans of telling us what it is. Ugh, you're right. Who cares? <laughs> the OA. We don't have enough time to cover all of the lingering mysteries from the finale of the OA, so we'll just focus on the big one. Is it all just a story? That is the major debate plaguing the internet right now. If her story was fake, then how did she gain her sight back after being blind most of her life? But if she was telling the truth, why did she have those books hidden in her room? But if it was fake, how did they stop the shooter at the school? But if it was real, what happened to the other angels? I know because I am the original angel. If it was fake, where was she, and who was she talking to in the final scene? We could go back and forth for a while, and that's exactly what the writers intended, so we'll just have to beg and plead for a season two in order to clear things up for good. There are tons of TV shows out there, so we're certain we missed some of your favorites. What mysteries are you still waiting to be solved? Let us know in the comments. Please hit that like button if you enjoyed this video, and don't forget to subscribe to CBR for the latest and greatest videos on comic books, TV shows, movies, video games, pop culture, and more.